Yo, what's up guys, Timmy here, welcome back to another d Chic video. Today we have another top five from the brand. Today we have Armani, and this line we're gonna talk in particularly about Armani Code. Now Armani Code is definitely one of the most legendary line of fragrances out there. I'm just gonna say it right now. It is one of my most favorite line of fragrance, period. The DNA just works. They're all massive, massive peelers, so they pull compliments really well. They all perform well. They're all very practical, versatile, and they just, again, they absolutely work. In majority of situations, you will pull reaction from all these fragrances I'm gonna mention in today's video. And even the ones that I don't mention in today's video, you're gonna pull reactions from. So this whole line, fantastic line. So I do have one honorable mention and that is Armani Code A-List. So Armani Code A-List is the one with the red band. I'll show you a picture of you guys on the screen right now. That one smells very similar to the original DNA. So that's why it's in the honorable mention because it is pretty much the original DNA, but a slightly bit different in the dry down, I guess. But at the end of the day, that one will again, pool compliments just as well as the original one. Original one is in this list somewhere. I'm not gonna tell you guys where, but um, yeah, A-list, honorable mentions, smells extremely good. You can definitely wear that one if you want like a, uh, a more stylistic bottle, I guess. If you look at the original bottle, the all black bottle, you don't like it, you want a red band on there, go with the red band A-list version. Smells absolutely the same to me from my nose with a light, slight bit of differences, but same kind of benefit. You'll get a lot of reaction from it, performs well. So yeah, A-list, honorable mentions. Let's jump into the number five spot now. Number five is one that is a summer version of the Code line. This one is Amani Code. Colonia. Colonia here, very clean summary. This one is the, the least strong performance ones of the bunch, but still we'll pull some compliments for sure. This one is nice, clean. The tonka bean in here is very much toned down in the background, but still very nice, clean white t-shirt vibe with some darkness, some depth at the base. It smells extremely nice for the summertime. Office time as well, majorly perfect for the office time. This one is just a summer star. It doesn't smell like your typical summer fragrance where it's just fresh, citrusy. This one is more like clean, but still has a lot of reserved darkness about it. So that's why I like this one a lot. And in terms of season, springtime, summertime works really well. And daytime, nighttime, I would say both work really well. In terms of occasion, wear this one casually if you want to. Wear this one to the office if you want to. There's no bad time to wear this one. It's very, very versatile for those season. So yeah, wear this one absolutely anytime. As a signature scent, you will pull some compliments and it will smell different from a lot of other fragrances that a lot of other people are wearing. Number four spot is um, a limited edition, I guess. Not really been confirmed or denied that it is sold out or anything. This one is Amani Code Absolute Gold. This one is a flanker of a flanker. This one is a flanker of the Absolute line. This is, gosh, it's just smoother. Out of all the three, the Absolute Gold, the Absolute, and the Profumo, this one is the smoothest and richest of the bunch. So if you like it's just an extremely smooth, sweet Amani Code DNA, this one is gorgeous. It's just really nice. Again, same DNA as the Absolute, just smoother. So what does that mean? That means that the Absolute DNA, and let me just explain that one really quickly. It works extremely well. Sweet, mass appealing. This one, same sweet, mass appealing, just smoother, that's all. This one is at the number four spot simply because it's the most expensive one and it might be limited edition. That's the only reason it's on here. Otherwise, it might be slightly bit higher on the list because I do like this one a little bit more than the Absolute, but the Absolute one is definitely cheaper. And it's definitely gonna be one that's gonna stick around. This one might not be the one that sticks around forever. So yeah, hence why this one is at the number four spot. But absolutely fantastic fragrance, performs well. In terms of season, this one is smoother and richer. So it's fall and winter time is the best time to wear this one. In terms of vacation, wear this one anytime. It's a signature scent for those type of vacation. It's smooth enough to where you can wear it to a formal occasion. So it adds that onto the list as opposed to the other two on the same line that doesn't really smell too formal. This one, you can wear it also in a formal occasion alongside wearing it to the club and all the other occasion that the other two work in. So yeah, absolute gold. Number four spot. Number three spot right here, we have Armani Code, the original absolute right here. The first one before the other one. <laughs> 
This one is really nice. I like this one just as much as the other one. It, it goes back and forth, depends on the day for me, to be honest with you. But this one's at the number three spot because it is more mass appealing, it's easier to find, and it's also cheaper, and it performs slightly bit better in the projection department because it has a little bit more of a freshness, a little more of a uh, effervescent type of sweetness. It's not as smooth or rounded off, so this one, very nice, creamy, sweet, really, really silky. This one, oh God, it just smells like a silky, gold, smooth, sweet fragrance. It smells fantastic. Very attractive, and it's one that will pull you a lot of compliments. Performance, again, is well, so you cannot go wrong with this fragrance whatsoever. This one is gonna be for people who you like very sweet fragrance, but you want something a little bit more like not so juvenile in a way. So Perfumo is a little bit juvenile with this root beer-ish kind of sweetness. This one is more like 25 up, 30 up kind of sweetness where a little bit more smooth, silky, more reserved. So if you like Perfumo, but you want a kind of like an older version of Perfumo, this one is the one to go for. In terms of season, wear this one. Spring, fall, winter time, and summer, nighttime, you can wear this one because it just smells, again, really, really nice. And the sweetness in here, to be perfectly honest with you, not too pungent, not too strong. That's why summer evenings work just as well. In terms of vacation, wear this one on a date, wear this one to the club, wear this one. Generally, anytime when you're outdoors in the cooler season, it will work with you really, really well. So yeah, really like this one. Amani Code Absolute, the original one, number three spot on this list. Number two spot is Amani Code Profumo. This one I have tons of history with. I wear this one a lot when I was in Thailand to the club and to the bar. This one is a fantastic nights out fragrance. Very young smelling, but at the same time invigorating. Just, man, this is just the most mass appealing Amani Code fragrance in this whole entire line. If you're looking for just pure compliments, this is one to go for. There's no, you don't even need to look at the number one spot. Just go with this one. This is the most mass appealing one, the strongest projecting one as well, and also the longest lasting one because the sweetness in here, so effervescent, so piercing that it lingers around in the air really well. It's a really strong head turning fragrance as well because the piercingness helps to grab attention and it lasts a long time. 10, 11, 12 plus hours in this one. Longest lasting Armani Code fragrance. Smells absolutely fantastic, it's one of the most Gosh, one of my most complimented fragrances of all time, to be perfectly honest with you. This one though, is slightly bit on the juvenile side in terms of sweetness, so if you're looking for something smoother, again, go with the Absolute version, but if you don't care about that, go with this one. Absolutely a better fragrance than the Absolute version. In my personal opinion, from my experience and usage, this one, more mass appealing, pulls more attention, hence why I like this one more than the Absolute. And for me, I don't really mind a juvenile type of sweetness, I'm young myself, so yeah, I really like this one. Amani Code Perfumo. Tons of history with this one, and it works for me every time. Number one fragrance, we have the original Amani Code. This one, ah, oh God, what to say about this one? Tons of memory with this fragrance right here. I've worn this one to, oh, first let me explain myself with this bottle. This is an Amani Code bottle, not Amani Code Absolute. Not absolute gold, this is just a limited edition Amani Code. It's just gold, but same smell as the black bottle. This one, tons of memory. I wore this one throughout college to the club. It's one of my most common fragrance of all time. I had tons of memories with this one. A lot of my friends love this one. A lot of my ex-girlfriends love this one. It's just a fantastic fragrance filled with just memories. It's the one that got me hooked onto the Amani Code line. It's one that got me hooked onto the Tonka Bean. It just works. And this is one that, oh God, like I said again, it's a tried and true DNA. It's the original DNA. It's just one that you cannot go wrong wearing in any era, it's very timeless. The newer formulation is a little bit reformulated so it doesn't last nearly as long as the old one but if you're wearing it for the first two, three hours to the bar or to the club, absolutely still works just as well. So don't let that deter you from wearing the original DNA. Still really like this one. So yeah, in terms of season, wear this one anytime. It's a very versatile DNA, summer, spring, fall, winter, does not really matter. In terms of vacation, wear this one again anytime as well. I wore this one as a signature scent throughout college and I loved every second of wearing this one. It's just a massive, massive peeler. Head turning almost every time that I wear this, I will get some kind of compliment. So yeah, number one spot. The original Armani code, love this one. Especially if you're younger, if you're in college, again, take it from my college experience, which was really not too long ago, this one works. If you want something that just pull compliments, one that's not too expensive, and one that just works, Armani code, the original.
number one spot. All right, guys, that's it for this video today. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check out decanfity.com. We have decants of all the fragrances that I talk about here and all the fragrances that I talk about in majority of the videos on this um, channel as well. So check us out there. We do have um, new releases coming in all the time. So make sure to stay tuned to our newsletter and check back to our website per like periodically because we do add new fragrances all the time. New releases, both in niche and designer world. We're really on top of all of that. We do have reward programs as well for you guys to have a little bit of a savings for yourself. But yeah, a lot of benefits on there. A lot of perks. We're adding new things all the time. So check us out. Decampity.com. You want some amazing decants of designers or a niche. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, and don't forget to leave your top five down below. I'm curious to know as well. Bye.